Piece of cake. Video. Do a video. Hey. Do a video now. Do a video. Okay, okay, fine, fine. I'll do a video. I'll do a video. Jeez, camera's staring at me, making me feel all uncomfortable and stuff. Jeez. What's up, everybody? Speed, Demon 706 here, and I'm back with another video. And as many of you have probably noticed, I've been working on a lot of streaming. I have a lot of videos on YouTube that I've posted for streaming. And what I do is I post to YouTube and I post to Facebook at the same time with my streams. And I can understand that, you know, not all of you are interested in streams because the videos I've made have been catered towards different things, not sit there and just binge playing a game on in for about an hour or so. I got it. So uh, I'm, I'm going to be looking towards streaming and that's probably something I'm going to move towards in the future, but I'm still going to try to produce the same content that I've been producing in the past because it's been successful for me. And again, it's not about the viewers with the videos. It's simply because I like to have fun making videos. Now, of course, with the streaming in the end, yes, it's going to be about viewers, but that's a different topic, um, probably a different video. But just so you guys understand, I am going to be focusing more on my streaming so I can continue to figure out the loopholes, the do's, the don'ts, and making sure I can network and all that stuff. There's, there's a lot into it. But anyways, that's not why you're here. You're here because you want some cheat codes for Donkey Kong Country for the SNES. So without further ado, let's get into them. All right, so first we have the Bad Buddy code. So Bad Buddy, what that enables you to do is when you're doing two-player team, and you have your friend who doesn't want to tag you because they can just blow through all the levels, you get to tag yourself in. So in order to do this, go down to a race game, push the B button so you can get a race game to start flashing, and you're basically, basically going to push E, A, down, B, up, down, down, Y. And once that's done, you hear that chime. So now what you're going to do is you're going to get that race game to stop flashing by pushing the same B button and go to your two-player game or even start a new one. So, of course, you're going to start one of your levels and what you want to do is make sure you have both controllers plugged in so you can test and verify this works. So for me, I know you can't see my controllers, but I do have two controllers plugged in and I'm controlling Donkey Kong with player one. So what I do here is I can tag Diddy Kong and he can be in charge, but right now I'm pushing up and down and all these buttons, but he's not doing anything. You know, Donkey Kong wants to be in charge. So, all I have to do is just push the select button, and I'm in charge. Just like that. Alright, the next cheat isn't really a cheat, it's a glitch, and this is called the Silver Kong glitch. So what this allows you to do is, you do a certain sequence of events, and you get to basically change the palette of Rambi, and it's just another palette of Diddy Kong or Donkey Kong. So what we're gonna do first is we're gonna get Rambi out of the box and we're gonna take him back to the beginning of the stage. And what you wanna do is you wanna clear any enemies that could be in the way of you simply walking. Now, whenever you get back here, you're gonna leave Rambi right about here. There's no specific spot really, but I just prefer that. Now you're gonna go up to the top of the trees and you're gonna jump down and you're gonna get that metal barrel. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna throw that barrel and you're gonna ride on it. So once it hits the wall, you're gonna jump. And when you jump, you're gonna push and hold Y. As you pass Rambi, you're gonna tap B. Don't let go of Y. Rambi's gonna hit that barrel by default. I didn't push anything, I'm still holding Y. So what happens is, I'm now in the glitch. I will still be in the glitch until I release the Y button. While I'm in the glitch, I can still run and jump and do the normal functions. But once I release the Y button, I'm in the glitch and Rambi will change. And the only way to get back into this glitch is to simply repeat all of the steps all over again. And there we are. Now Diddy Kong is riding on top of another Diddy Kong pretty intense. The same thing can be done with Donkey Kong. Same thing, jump, Y, tap the B button, and release, and you are now riding yourself. This one actually looks like it fits. Just don't forget that if you jump or push Y, it brings you out of the glitch. All right, this next glitch is the minecart level skip. So all you have to do is jump over this barrel, hug the left side of the wall, and you're gonna be launched into a couple of barrels. It's gonna take you to the end of the stage, and all you have to do is just watch out for the skater right here in the cart, and you've completed a level. 
All right, this right here is the secret bonus room cheat, and in order to get there, we have to push down Y, down, down Y, or spell Diddy. This is done on Cranky's page when he's playing the music. If you do it right, you're gonna hear the tone, and the screen goes black, and you're gonna get taken to this bonus room. This has three of each golden animal found in Donkey Kong Country. You can touch these animals and do whatever you want to do, but you're going to have to reset your game because it always brings you straight back here. Alright, this next cheat is the 50 lives cheat. So go back into your menu and you're going to go down to erase game, highlight it, spell barrel. B-A-R-R-A-L. Barrel. Now you're going to go into your game, pick jungle hijinks or whatever you want to go to, and boom, right there. 50 balloons. Now, while we're here, this takes us to our next one, Infinite Lives. So, what you can do, only in Jungle Hijinks, go back up and you can go back into the house and you can pick up a balloon. So you get this balloon, now you have 51. Reset, go back in, and just do the same thing. Go back up there to get the balloon. Now, the only thing about this is you can't do it over and over in level. As you try to do it again, you're just blocked from going back inside. So yes, you gotta start and select, go out and go back in to get the balloon. But nonetheless, you can still get a balloon, and if you're having a hard time with a certain level, just come here and start spamming these balloons, and you should be good to go. All right, next is the level skip at the stop and go station. So once you enter the stop and go, just turn around and leave. And what that's gonna do is it's gonna take you straight to the end of the level. Hit a couple of go and stop barrels and you're on your way. All right, next, we're gonna talk about Infinite Lives 2. So if you remember that secret bonus room by spelling Diddy at Cranky Kong's intro page with the music, you're gonna do the same thing. However, you're gonna get a game over in game and then you're gonna do the Diddy input and then you're gonna to go to the bonus room, but don't collect any animals. Simply just push start and select. Now you should be back where you were before you got a game over. And bonus, if you hit that barrel for the save spot or the save point, that's where you start. Do this as many times as you need. Next, some honorable mentions. So these honorable mentions are cheat codes that I've looked up and even seen other YouTubers do, but I was unable to do them myself. World skip. So if you see Donkey Kong going back and forth between Coral Capers and Funky's Flights, that's what you're supposed to do, and the whole time you're supposed to be pushing the B button. And where that straight line breaks is where Donkey Kong should stop and the screen blacks out and he actually goes into a different level in World 3. So there's a similar thing that can be done between Ropey Rampage and Jungle Hijinks. But what you need to do is go into Jungle Hijinks and you have to make sure you're alone with no ditty. So you're gonna throw a barrel, but you're gonna pause it. Right there, keep the barrel suspended, and then go ahead and push select. Leave the stage. Now you're gonna do the same thing you did before. Just go back and forth between Ropey Rampage and Jungle Hijinks, except this time you're gonna be pushing the A button over and over. And once again, where you have that break in the line where it changes directions, Donkey Kong should stop and the screen should go black and he should enter a different stage. But you only have about one frame to get this. Next, Infinite Lives 3. I wasn't able to do this one as well, however I did see it on YouTube. You're gonna take Diddy Kong all the way to a Crusha that's located in this spot right here. You're gonna bounce on him with Diddy because Diddy can't kill them. However, you use this ledge to bounce back on and you should keep bouncing on him over and over. However, no matter how many times I've done it, I wasn't able to do it. Air Jumps. This one is another one I couldn't do. So basically you go to Minecart Carnage and then you hit this save point barrel. You either die or you get out of the level. Once you go back in, push and hold the B and Y button and you should jump out of the barrel. Keep pushing B and Y to start jumping on nothing basically and you can take yourself all the way to the end of the level. However, I was unable to do this. As you can see, I just die. But if any of you know how to do this, then more power to you. And you were able to do something I wasn't. But that's gonna do it for cheat codes and honorable mentions. Hope you enjoyed. And that is it guys. Hopefully this brings a little bit more happiness to your gaming whenever you wanna get back in touch with those old retro games. Hopefully this rekindles some of that fire that you had down inside for that old childhood game. If you need anything else, just post it down in the comments below. And if you're actually interested in my streaming, check out my Facebook page. I'll tag it in the description below. 
at speeddemon 806 and also I have a gaming group. You can post your memes, post your gifts, post your stories, your purchases, your achievements, anything like that. It's a, a fun place to be and it's more or less G-rated, um, so stop by. And that's called Speeds Demons Gaming Group. Speeds Demons Gaming Group. I'll try to link it in the box below as well. Other than that, that's all I got. I'm Speed Demon 806 Have a great day.